Three months on the road, three months of constant trial. But after Yamantau, we are ready for anything fate can throw at us. Mere kilometers separate us from the Caspian One communication center. Will the maps within yield a spot free from radiation where we could finally settle in peace? I don't know, but what's left for us but hope? The desert is taking its toll. The crew suffers from heat and thirst and the Aurora is not in her top form. We're out of coal and had to switch to burning available fuel. Old cross ties and twigs. I want to suck your blood. <laughs> Blah. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Metro Exodus. My name is Brian, your host and commentator, and here we are riding along the deserts of the Caspian Sea on the Aurora. You heard RTM, we are running low on fuel. Shit is not looking good. Anna is getting dehydrated or something. I don't know. I'm not in love with this place. Nothing but sand and heat. I feel like shit here. A car? Whoa! Artyom, a car! Wonder where they're heading off to. Somehow, I don't like this welcome either. Let's go. All right, here we are. It's game time. We'll stop this train. Like somebody lives there. I see. How are the men doing, Demir? Stepan is the worst off. The others are not so well either. Oh, only us here are still in fighting shape. <sighs> Thank you, Ada. You and Demir reconnoiter the area. We need to find the damn bunker and hit the road as soon as we do. We might have a slight problem with hitting the road, Colonel. And there's barely enough water in the boiler to make some tea. And we're all out of coal. I see. We'll need to address that too. Anna, Demir, one more task. Look for water and fuel. We'll do. Get the men ready. We need to set up defenses. Roger that. See you soon. Just try to be careful, all right? Artyom, we have to learn who those men with the car are. They do look like regular bandits, but we can't take risks here. The car was headed for the village. Looks like they have a comms relay there, and it should hold some info, which is just what we need now. Move out as soon as you're ready. Chris, so I can take can my your time? Car pull the train? It might, but really slowly and not for too long. The engine is too weak for the weight and we, we don't have much diesel left. Well, if we had enough diesel, <laughs> the Aurora wouldn't be needing any help. How so? Its firebox was originally designed for taking coal, but it also has high temperature lining and liquid fuel jets installed. Why didn't you say so before? Because you never asked. That's pretty fair. Injection system in working order. I would need to check it. Well, take crest and run the checks. Oh well, yeah, we'll take care of the chick chuck, no problem. But uh, that ain't giving us no diesel. Hmm. Judging how the locals drive around, it will be much easier to get our hands on diesel than coal around here. Uh, what about the water? Can't run without it, but our tanks are dry. Let's handle problems in the order of their appearance. All right, I guess that's it for that conversation. Everyone just kind of stares around. All right, let's go check those fuel sprinklers now. I bet they all need cleaning or something. And then these guys kind of just... Bunker, and we'll meet them on the outside when I go down here. Let's see. Hi, <clears throat> What's up, Duke? Oh, that's it? Okay. 
well. I guess we're gonna hop out here then. Uh, pull out our gun just for the fun of it. Yeah, don't know about this one. Seems weird, but I can't put a finger on it. Uh, make a note there. Sure, we check this one. So they kind of just say this over and over again in like three different ways. They're just like, ah, this one's loose. We need to look at this one. Ah, this one's blah. So that's uh, that's what that's all about. Yo, Demir, aren't you supposed to be? This one is okay. I think that's Demir. <laughs> aren't you? I don't know. Supposed to be doing some. Looks like it used to house a ticket office and lockers. Full of garbage now. Could use some cleaning. Damn. Let's go ahead and get the only collectible in this chapter. It's this postcard right here. Not chapter, I'm sorry, this episode. nothing to get in here in fact this actually becomes like converted into your base for the time being once we come back um looks like we cannot get into the is he overheating or whatever the the train the passenger car whatever it's called i'll relieve him once we get step on here yeah we'll handle that well i'm off too rtm we can handle it here Oh, so I gotta leave. Let's see if Idiot has anything else to say. I don't think he does. I don't think either of them do. Let's go talk to Sam really quick up here. Man, I'm trying to get this, like, microphone <laughs> kind of in a better... There we go. This might be a good spot for me to record now. All right. You're gonna hear some bumping around, but that's all right. It's not a big deal. Do you see that building with the antenna? Oh, this is Alyosha. The I thought this was Sam. Way. Sam's down there. That's Be right. Be careful Whoops. out there, though. We don't know what to expect from the locals. Be careful. I could do that. Twenty-nine. Okay, so I got a bit of ammo for that. Let me go ahead and. Charge this bad boy all the way up to pump it up. I'm here to pump you up. Oh no, never mind. Maybe we get the the extra whatever stock enhancement when we come back to the Aurora later. All right, let's continue. There's a couple of critter dens to get. We got. I wish I could. All right, well, there's the axe. We're going to get one... No, we're going to get two critter dens on the way there. We're going to fill in two of those on the map, and then we're going to hit that spot. That's all we're really doing uh, this episode. We're investigating that, and then we're going to head back to the Aurora afterwards. So, just to give you an idea, there's a body with some goodies on it. Check out these other little rail cars. Got ourselves another body. Apparently, it's a bit radioactive here. Here's a rail. Or, no, we checked that one, didn't we? Yeah, we just did. Okay, <laughs> nothing in here. There are some human animals wandering around, though, in this area. This is the critter den. And a storm is brewing. Oh, well, here we go. This is the, uh, see, I thought this was a fucking safe house at first, but then it was like, nope, this is a critter den. Got me good, game. Oh, shit. Ah! <laughs> I'm trying not to use this ammo, but looks like I have to. Ooh, ouch. Damn it. I fucked up. Huh? Oh my god, Brian. Learn how to... I'm 
I'm so gonna die. That was pathetic. All right. All right. Round two. Hold on. <laughs> I'm a sick motherfucker. All right, let's go. <laughs> I wasn't sure. I mean, I assumed you could kill the birds, but I hadn't actually done it yet, so it's funny. All right. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be sneaky this time. That was bad. I went in guns a blazing like an idiot. Oh shit! Whoa! Oh god! There's so much for that sneak. This game was like, nope. Doesn't look like it alerted the others, though, so it's good. I forgot they blend in like that, like... Just right into the environment, all looking like rocks. I think Demir calls them chameleons. He's like, ah, he's fucking chame chameleons. Oh, shit. Ooh, get that leg blown off. Alright, let's get up here. We're gonna take some cover. Hang out in here. Did I get two of them? Twofer? Ooh, that was a twofer! One shot for two. This is going much better than the last attempt. I have no idea where these guys are. Well, I'm gonna grab these components. Oh shit, there he is. Is that it? I think it is. Alright, cool. So we have a new uh, weapon here. I haven't seen this yet, or maybe you have, and I just completely missed it. I don't think I did, though. I think it gets introduced in this level, along with another weapon that I'm going to totally going to pick up. Uh, let's go ahead, and I'm going to just scoop this really quick. The valve, it's kind of like the sniper. I should have used this against those guys. Man, all right. Well, anyway. There's still a guy. Still a human animal. There he is. Fucker. Another one. There's another one. <laughs> Where are these guys? I can't see them. They blend in so so damn well. Oh, he's up top there. I see him. Right. At least I thought I saw him. Man. Come on, I shot him in his leg. Didn't blow his leg off. dead now aren't you <laughs> all right so cool and that's gonna mark that critter den on our map look at that boom we got the critter den all right we got one more to get it's really close by i think that's it for uh this little section too over here this little area with the the, the hut i don't know the hut with the sniper whatever you want to call it well, that guy's dead Anything cool in your truck? Oh, that's... Ow, shit. It's not cool. That's a lot of dead bodies is what that is. I'm running low on shotgun ammo. I have two, two rounds. Shit. Alright, time to be a little bit more sneaky about all this. Let's see, the other critter den is right up here. I believe it's kind of like east east of that X a little bit. There's a, it's a dead human animal. Maybe it's this little diner area, if I remember correctly. There's a skull on a thing. Actually, that critter den might be here in these ruins. There's an autosave. Beautiful. Nice. I was being a lot more careful because I was like, shit, I have not gotten autosave in a while. And that's going to set me back a bit. <laughs> uh, eat it. Oh, God. Just like pop, pop, pop. Ooh, man, it's getting dark out and sandy and dusty. Just 
Trying to figure out where this critter den mark is. And I can't. Maybe it's in these, I think it's in these runes, possibly. Ouch. Fuck. Unloaded on that motherfucker. Oh, damn it. Come on. I'm like trying to figure out how to. Alright, cool. We got this. I'm going to pump this back up. Reload it. Looks like it is reloaded. Yeah. Your gunshots from the, uh, the whatever over there. Ritter done. Oh shit. Eat my lead balls. My bullet. Because they're balls, you know? Bullets are balls. <laughs> um That's too far east. We are too far east. It's kind of nice to explore this stuff, though, a little bit. Because <clears throat> we are going to, like, hit all this stuff up anyway, because there's goodies and stuff. So I guess I'm kind of just taking it in the order that I, I don't know, that I feel, that I come across. goodies in here what do we got come on I need this ammo shotgun ammo please there we go I like this I didn't see any ammo in there though so that kind of sucked that's it well this guy thinks he's sneaky he's not though I guess if you come around this corner he ambushes you maybe maybe that's how those are set up I don't know those little like cinematic you know cutscenes where they're like wah and get all wild on you you gotta like beat him off. Not <laughs> that sounded gross. Not in that sense. You gotta beat him off of you. There we go. I should have ended with you. Off of you. Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, that was a headshot. Holy shit. I got him with a headshot. I like it. There's some components there, so that's groovy. Weird zombie sand ruins. I like it. It's what I feel like I'm exploring right now. These, like, zombie sand ruins. There we go. Got the Critter Den mark. Ooh. There it is. We got two Critter Dens now. I hear a snarl. Oh, my God. Move. No. I hear snarling. Hop over this. Get into combat position. Maybe I should retreat into this, uh... Door front here, whatever this thing is. Damn it, how do I get in here? I remember this thing now. I remember it. That's not how you get in, though. <laughs> That's not how you get that. You can't actually get in. Must be over here. Ooh. Just gonna snip that. That must have been an alarm. Let the baddies know that you're here. Dead body, container, uh, dead body, is that it? The snake better not bite me, we got this cool thingamajig, uh, I don't know, outpost signifier marker, I don't know what to call it, ooh, there's something red going on in here. You saw that, right? There was like a red hint glow over here. I don't know. Where'd it go? Why is it gone? Let's get all that, though, before we finish up. That's how you get in. It's all the way on the opposite side of me. 
Silly me. All right, let's get over here. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. RTM, leap. Use those Russian leaping legs. Are Russians known for leaping? I wouldn't know. I'm not Russian. I'm Polish. I'm half Polish. So, I'm I'm Eastern European, Slavic half, and then the other half is uh, was it Scottish, German, and English? Like a quarter English, and then um, an eighth Scottish, and an eighth German. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. We got a fortress to get to. I think we're done exploring these ruins. That was really the only thing of note. That I recall. Let's get on top of the roof, actually. Let's see. Let's see what's up here. Don't want to leave this out. Okay, maybe we could have left this out. There's nothing up here. Alright, let's... Oh, shit. I probably shouldn't do that because our team takes fall damage very easily in this game. And I am not about that. Especially because I don't know how many... Let me look at my shit really quick. Shit, really quick. I have, see, I have no med packs. Let me make a couple of those. And I guess I can't really do a whole lot. I'll make ten more of those just in case. All right, gunshots. We're coming. We hear you. It's getting really dusty and sandy out. I'm not sure I came towards this lump of humanoid that was clearly on the ground. Oh, is this thing? You must have caught it on fire. Gotta put on your gas mask. Oh God, put that away, Artyom. Who oh, charge that battery? We got some combat to do. <laughs> All right, let's go. Ah, I'm out. All right. Fuck, man. Should have reloaded. The other one just, like, run off. He took off. He was like, fuck this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit! Ah. Oh, I whiffed on both of those. Oh, God! Huh. Ah, I'm out of... <laughs> I'm out of just all my ammo. Um, all right, let's see. What do I have? Oh god. All right. Oh my god, I missed. It. All right, well this will kill him, so that's actually kind of helpful. I have no ammo right now. I need to make some ammo when we get back to the Aurora. I think I took care of them all, though. Look at that. Yeah. Just took me like three Molotovs and a missed throwing knife and all my ammo. All right, well, glad I charged this later. I, I, I could have done it, you know, probably when I was not in combat, but I kind of accidentally pulled it out, and I was like, fuck it, let's do this. And I don't think... There's some there's quite a bit of stuff to get in this building, but I don't think it's really down here on the lower floor. Maybe in here. Eh. It's a dead... Must have killed a lot of these guys. I'm going to light this fire. Just for the hell of it. Nothing over here. I'm gonna change my filter too. I feel like it might be getting low. Oh, I don't need it when I'm in here. I'm gonna keep it on anyways, just in case. I'm gonna make this more intense. See, now the time's going down. I guess I do need it. It's going down really fast too. That's way quicker than one one per set, like one second. Must be the sandstorm intensifying. Man, everything must be up top. I can't wait to get the new gun though. There's gonna be a new gun that I'm actually gonna keep and hold on to. The next shotgun. Ooh, there we go. Checkpoint. It's a dead end, though. Waste of my time. Waste of all our times. You're watching me. I'm running into dead ends. This fucking game. Oh, shit. Shit. I had my throwing knives out. Ugh. All right, how am I going to do this? Yes. Yes. Let's have that third one run into it, too. Why not? I should probably craft some, uh, some bullets. Hopefully none of them get through. 
They're all like, ah, it hurts. And I'm like, yeah, it's supposed to hurt. It's fire. You guys, you guys attacked me. Three on one. How is that fair? I don't care about your damn misery. You're just a, just a monster anyway. You're not even a human. You're like a human that's turned animal. <laughs> a human animal. Oh, fuck. I took care of him pretty quick. There's the radio. Well, I guess there's a lot less than I thought to get in here. Unless it's all just on the top. Top flow. There we go. There's something. Let's see, was there any shotgun ammo? No. Oh, but you, you bet your ass there's some assault rifle ammo. In fact, there were three bullets. Look at that. All right, let's go in here. Let's kick this shit open. I have a minute 25 left. Gross. I need more. Maybe I'll have to make another canister. Actually, I don't think I do need to. I believe the sandstorm leaves after this uh, kind of storyline part. Oh, shit. You made a mistake coming here. All right. So you could kill him or you can knock him out. Um, this guy does have some play later on, so I'm going to knock him out. And you get a morality point. You know I like them morality points. So we'll just knock him out for now. He, uh, he shows up later if you do knock him out. If you kill him, then he's like replaced by somebody else for a different cinematic thing. Here's a zipline to take us back down. But fuck that noise. I'm picking up this new shotgun that I just acquired. Look at that. It's the, uh, what is it? It's not the Nasher, the, uh, damn it, what's it called? Let's see. The Shambler. Oh, shit! Oh, come on. I was hoping those three bullets would kill him. I don't know why. Hopefully these are the only two that I have to deal with. This is really intense. Not going my way at all. Nope, it's not the only two. Great. <laughs> Fuck, man. Where'd this dude come from? <laughs> that was too much right now. <laughs> Go ahead and beat the shit out of that. Fucker. Oh, I hate human animals. Oh, any more? Are there any more? Let me heal. Are there any more? Holy shit, that was intense. I was like, what the fuck's going on? There was like way too much. Way too much going on. Oh shit, there are. They're like, yeah, you wanted more, you got more. Fuck them out. Ah, oh, it won't let me use it. Why won't it let me use it? Buy me some time while I craft some more pellets. My pellet gun. Here, we'll go. Fuck it, I'll just go 40 since I have no other ammo. I'll do one of those two. Alright. I really need to go make some bullets at the Aurora. Gonna stand on that fire like a clown. There. Holy shit. I still hear one. He must he actually he, yeah, they're down there. I was gonna say there's some of them down by the car. One of them sounded really loud, so I'm a little worried now. Alright, let's just get out of here. Let's roll. We gotta bounce. We gotta hit the Aurora. We got the key to this car now. Just jacked it from, uh... Well, that guy's name was Saul. They were saying it on the radio and stuff. Oh, fuck! What the hell? 
All right, when you try and get into the car, you're going to get, uh, like, ambushed. So you want to take out as many humanimals as you can right now. So we can fight as few as possible. I should probably take off this mask now. Recharge my battery while this guy... There he is. It's about damn time. I've been waiting for you. You hit me with that rock. Oh! Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, yeah. It's, I, we still got it. Damn it. All right. Oh, I'll just get in this car. I hope you manable doesn't kick me out of it. Oh, what do you know? This is exactly what I didn't want. All right. Let's go ahead and get through this. Oh, look at that. There's like four of them. Key back, pal. Yeah. There you go. Snap his neck. Get your key back. Oh, cool. Okay. Yeah, I forgot Demir shows up. Never mind. You're good then. I guess I just wasted bullets. So, there's probably no chance to have a chat with the owners of this car. What a shame they're so silent. No, had I had a car like this, I wouldn't want to give it up either. <laughs> in my book, driving beats walking in this heat any day. <laughs> Which reminds yeah, I hear me, that. you've got a good test drive opportunity. <laughs> While you were playing in this sandbox, I found some antennas. And the communication center should have them. <laughs> I think it's at that lighthouse, so you should head there. The lighthouse is so huge, we can't miss it. I have to stay and keep tabs on the area for a while, but once I'm done, I might join you there. See ya! Sounds like a plan. Alright, let's go ahead and hop in here. And you will get the checkpoint. Look at that. Well... <laughs> Everyone, the Baron is about to speak. Listen up, everyone. The Baron is speaking. So we're gonna listen to this, and then I'm gonna end the episode here because we just got the checkpoint. And we'll head back to the Aurora next episode in this thing. Talk to everyone. As far as I remember, we did a pretty good job of teaching the neighbors that actions like this end up costing them. These newcomers seem slow on the uptake, or not from the neighborhood. In any case. We should find out who they are and what they want. I'll call the people that I need separately. The rest of you are to ready your cars, guns, and combat trained slaves. It might all be needed soon. As you were, everyone, the Baron has spoken. All right, well, with all that being said and done, I'm going to end the episode here. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and consider subscribing if you find this stuff useful you can also follow me on twitter if you want my name is brian and hopefully i'll see you in the next one